Now that Mike's running for mayor, he's in the spotlight. One of the wonderful attributes about Mike is that he's worked hard for this city for years and years and years. He was behind Berkeley Park. He's behind the renovation of Columbus Park, but he never cared about the spotlight. But Mike was involved in making so many things happen in Kansas City that nobody ever knows about, and he'll do the same as mayor. You should vote for Mike because Mike has worked with our city in many different roles for a long, long time. Mike is an honest man. He understands government. He understands how a city works and all the different departments. Mike understands that and he's a consensus builder and we really need that. If you get a chance to talk to him, you really, you'll begin to realize that he is passionate about this city. Um, when you begin to talk to him, he the ideas, they're straightforward. They, he doesn't kind of beat around the bush. He tells you like it is, and, and they actually make sense to, will make sense to everybody, but particularly young people. I, I believe that Mike is a man of integrity, and he does what he says he's gonna do. I think that's a difficult thing to find in a, in a politician. He is a dreamer, to be sure, but he's not afraid of his dreams, as many people are. He, that makes him a man of action. What he does is he looks at his dreams, he decides whether they're realistic or not, and then he figures out some way to implement them. There, there's one thing that uh, you might fault my dad for, and that's working too hard. Uh, once he starts a project, he doesn't back off until it's finished. To be a mayor requires special characteristics. Do you think Mr. Burke has those? Yes, if I you, do. If you could name three, or the top three, what would they be? I would say honesty. Wow. He's a straight shooter. There's no hidden agenda. Confidence. As mayor, he would make the citizens of our city proud to be Kansas Cityans. Bravery. Bravery, huh? It's understood that when neighborhoods are small and they don't appear to be mighty, People have a tendency to walk on them, but Mike Burke isn't gonna allow people to walk on small neighborhoods. I think Mike would be very conscious of promoting economic opportunities in and for Kansas City. He's got his arms around that stuff, and so he can bring to it that level of understanding and his commitment and energy to, to really make some things change and become much more friendly to new development, which we need. He really understands what other cities have been doing with regards to economic development, with regards to job creation, and I think those two issues are extremely important in this time of, of our uh, economy right now. Mr. Burke is trying to make a better Kansas City for me and all the other kids. He is a man of his word. Mike will represent us very well. I think he works really hard. He would be the city's number one cheerleader. He is passionate about this city. I think I've uh, mentioned a few reasons why I think Mike Burke should be mayor. Number one, he's, he's, he's got leadership capabilities. Number two, he's honest. Number three, he's intelligent. Most importantly, number four, he cares about Kansas City.